Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Did you know that I found the love of my life thanks to YouTube and Facebook? It's true. I didn't even realize that uh, she was watching me. It's kind of that's not to say that Diana was a stalker or anything. You weren't, right? <laughs> Hope not. Have you ever dated someone from the internet? I mean, not that it's a country, uh, <laughs> but uh, this place uh, online uh, from a social network, or have you used one of those online dating services, which aren't as bad, or they don't have as much of a stigma associated with them as it used to be, uh, it's acceptable. Uh, we've, you know, written up a, really, a, a, you know, our thoughts on uh, wondering if social dating is the new next hot way to find your next hot date. Have you found a hot date through the internet? If so, how and where? And you may be thinking to yourself, oh, no one's going to fall in love with me. Dude, what have you done? You know, where are you? Uh, do you lurk? Do you troll? Are you active? Where are you active? Where are you going to find the love of your life? And you may just be doing the thing that you're doing anyway, and they're going to find you. That's exactly what happened. And it was all innocent and everything. In fact, she was a little embarrassed when I realized I thought we had met uh, somewhere else because uh, I'd been at a... It's another story. I think I, I shared it in another video. It was completely innocent. And uh, it, I was very, very lucky. Had it not been for a video I did on the iPhone, I would not have found Diana. She would have found me. Well, no, she probably wouldn't have found me either. So I wouldn't have found her. It's kind of the, if we traveled back in time and did all this crazy stuff. So uh, if you have some good stories related to how you found your soulmate online, feel free to share them as a comment, video response, or even on the article itself, uh, which we're really trying to give a construct to, thinking that, being social, being yourself is going to be the best way you're going to attract that person who's going to compliment you for the rest of your life. And I'm going to go ahead and plus one this, like Daniel Johnson, Sean Jordan, Skylar Johnson, Stacey Ferris, and Matthew Sabia have, and tweet it. Uh, leave your stories. I'm just curious to know. We, we can't be the only couple out there who have met thanks to uh, being social. What about you?